What's up? My name is Heather. Welcome to the tailoring department of I'll Take You to the Costume Shop, where we will fit any garment you got. I have your appointment logged as a multifaceted one. We're going to be taking your measurements, then doing a fabric color selection, thread selection, and then adjusting a garment that you brought, suit jacket. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Have you ever had a fitting done before? It's super easy. I have my handy dandy measuring tape, and I'm going to be going from the top of your body, from your neck, down to your ankle. I'm going to be logging the measurements as I go on my little notebook. Okay? It's gonna go faster than you think. So if you don't mind, I'm going to get started with your neck. I'm not going to pull it tight. You don't have to worry. I leave two fingers in between your skin and the tape. Hang on, let me just... Okay, because I want to give you room to breathe. Oh, okay, good. Let me just log that. your thumb. So if you would, just stand straight for me. Okay? Thank you. measurements. So I'm going to start at the front of the body. You just have to stand straight. And I'm going to connect your underarms so over the biggest part of your chest. Lift your arms up for me. And now down. Wrap it around. And I keep two fingers inside so that you'll have room to move in the garment. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. 
then I'm going to do your stomach. So I'm going to go around you all right so I can just like with your chest, I'm going to need you to put your arms up. part of the stomach. Always leaving a little room for mobility. Good. All right. Arms up. long. Gets in the way sometimes. All right, now I'm going to do the back. So, just like before, with the front, I'm going to need you to stand straight. I'm going to do the back panel, which is one underarm to the other. Connect the armpits. So I'm gonna come behind you. Okay. Stand straight for me. This is easy. It's sort of like a Connect your shoulders. So I'm going to go from one end of your shoulder over your back to the other shoulder. I'm going to be really precise here so that the seams match. Very good. And now we're going to go from the shoulder to the wrist. Stand straight for me. Don't try to lengthen your arms. Just stay relaxed. Shoulder to your wrist. And from here I'm going to add about a half an inch. inches for movement. Okay. Alright. I'm going to do your waist. So, 
going to put the measuring tape where you like your pants to sit on you, okay? measuring tape thong. This is probably going to be the least comfortable part for you. I'm going to go from the top of your pants in the front to the top of your pants in the back. biggest part of the thigh I'm going to go from your waist all the way down to your heel. measurement and multiply that Easy peasy lemon squeezy because that's all the measurements I needed. So I can put this away. Do you mind if I just take a second to roll it up? Otherwise, it'll get really tangled. It's super long. Look, 
see that? I haven't even done anything. Then it got tangled. Seriously though. There we go. and neat. Alright, let me get you your color and thread choices. different threads. This one's like a hunter green. You have pink, tangerine, silver, baby blue. This is like a chocolate mustard. Lilac. Where is a nude? Yellow. This is an interesting one. It's sort of iridescent. Kind of like a teal. This is like a Merlot. Baby pink. Fuchsia. Another kind of mustard yellow. Oh, yeah. This is kind of like an Easter purple. Another yellow. Another mustard. Another pink. Uh, white. Another shade of pink. Nice dark brown. in a darker. This one's really pretty. Can you see how pretty that one is? It's a very dark, beautiful blue-green. And then, off the rack of the threads, I also have some singles. Let me show you. green thread. They're both very dark. They also have really, really nice majestic purple and another wine color. Both very pretty. It's your garment, so you can pick whatever you like for whatever garment part you want. If you want all different kinds of thread, you are free to make that choice. I also have a couple of reds. And then I have a couple of blues in 
here Pretty nice I'll let you see for yourself We have a nice robin psycho blue and a blue gray kind of like a cloudy day um, 100% spun polyester it's very soft alright and I think that's about it mm-hmm. yep okay so now let me show you your fabric color choices Just move this aside, you can think about it Make a decision later Take a look at them again later It's up to you Move these pins out of the way Oh! Before I forget, you wanted zippers, correct? I pulled this based on the criteria you gave. Is this an okay zipper? It uh, has a neat sort of like a, a pine cone embellishment. And I can attach them. Whatever you want Over your garment You want one on both sides, so just for my knowledge Here So your sleeve opens like that on this side And do you want a symmetrical design? Like this? Yeah. Well, you think about it. Alright. Let's get your fabric color. Any of those strike your fancy Okay, let's keep going You just make a mental note of anything that catches your eye, okay Then we have Ultramarine green Conductive chartreuse Moving right along, we have Stabler and Benson Blue Littlefoot Bartok Matte Blue Sweet Release The Kraken Cobalt And Jack Skellington Pine And then the last row Includes a 
give you a copy if you want to take home and you can call us back when you make your choice. Okay. Now let me have a look. is an interesting it's sort of like a suit well, as long as you've got your suit and tie you can show people a few things Shoulder to shoulder, the seam should match up and sit in the right place. Just stand straight for me, please. I want to make sure that the sleeves. so that the thumb line is always open. The jacket should end where your thumb ends, as far as length goes. Okay, so I'm going to need to do some pinning. That's obvious. Nothing too bad. Just need to take it in on a few places. Yeah. Now, um, these ruffles on it, I'm just going to move them to see if they need reinforcement. Otherwise, it'll just look like saggy fabric. Or they'll pucker and dimple where they're not supposed to. Okay. On this side.
Let's get to pinning. Don't worry, I'm not going to poke you. You do have to wear the garment though so I can adjust it to where it needs to be on your okay? You just have to be patient. This is... to uh, trim a little bit off and hem it here and here by my fabric scissors so just a little Save that fabric just in case I need to add it anywhere. And I think that should be it. Okay, so you are all done. I told you it would be fast. <laughs> what I'm going to do after you leave over the next couple weeks 
is create the first garment as per your design requests using the colors that you picked, the thread that you picked, and putting that together based on your measurements. I'm also going to be adjusting the second garment that you brought in. So when you come back, you'll be doing a first fitting for the first garment, and you should be it's your first fitting on your second garment, but it should be take home ready. You'll do a second fitting another day on the first garment, though. You want it to be perfect, right? Okay, well, I'll be seeing you soon for your fittings. I think I have all the information I need, and I can't wait to work on it. It was nice meeting you. Take care. See you soon.